Hey guys, it's Matt, and welcome to a Matt Monday video. So I don't really know why, but recently I've been thinking about my childhood a lot and things that happened during my childhood. So I thought I'd start making videos about my childhood, which I've already done last week, but I'm gonna continue it into this week. So today's video is going to be the story of the sandwich. So this story goes all the way back into preschool for me. Preschool was basically a giant playground where I would just play all day with all my friends and have fun with all the other preschoolers in the class. But of course, in every preschooler grade that you're in or school, there's that one person who nobody likes and who bullies everyone else in the class. And I'm not gonna call her by her name because that would just be rude and mad disrespectful. So we gonna call her Melinda. Okay, so there was this girl, Melinda, that nobody liked, and she pretty much bullied everyone. The reason people didn't like her is because she was mean and she would like force you into doing things that you didn't want to do. In my preschool, there was this sandbox that we had inside the preschool that everyone liked playing with. You know, it was something that everyone fought over. So when you had time to play in the sandbox, you would go to the sandbox and play in it. One day, I think for some reason, everyone went outside to play, and me and a couple other kids who were like wimps, just like stayed indoors because we're like, oh, I'm not gonna finish try with the nature as out there. Me and these couple other kids are staying there and for some reason all those other kids didn't want to play with the like sandbox. Like they were all playing like house and kitchen and I was not about that life. So the minute I realized that I could have the sandbox to myself, I like ran over to play with the sandbox. Next thing I know, Melinda walks up and she's like, I'm gonna play in the sandbox. And I was like, so, me being the nice kid I am, because I'm totally not shady, I was like, all right, I'm gonna play with you, I'm gonna play in the sandbox by myself, but I'm just gonna pretend that you don't even exist, because your existence doesn't matter, because you're that basic to me. I start playing in the sandbox, I'm like, oh, I'm digging for fossils, you know, pretending, like, living in my imaginary world. Over time, I progressively realized that Melinda is like tossing up the sand everywhere. I'm like, girl, you need to put that ish down because I have seen what happens when kids get sand in their eyes and I'm not about that life. I, I kind of give her like a, mm, girl, you gotta stop, look. Like a judgmental, like God is judging you for what you are doing in the sandbox kind of look. And as I give her this look, she takes a handful of sand in her hand and I was like, you better not. You better not do what I think you was about to do because if you is, you gonna die. She takes that handful of sand and she hurls it in my face and screams with laughter. And this is the part where I thought I was going to die. My eyes are basically covered in sand. It was like taking ice cream and dipping it in the sprinkles and taking it out. That's how covered my eyes were in the sand. So instantly, because of what happened, I reached for my eyes and start rubbing my eyes because I'm stupid and I don't realize that that's, that's gonna make things worse. So I rub my eyes and I scream for help and the preschool teacher runs up to help me and I get rushed out to the sink so that they can wash out my eyes. And as they're rushing out my eyes, I'm crying my heart out because I think I'm actually going to die. It hurts so bad, I thought I was gonna go blind. That's how bad things were. And as soon as we had finished washing out my eyes, of course the preschool teachers made me go talk to her and be like, she's gonna apologize to you for everything that's happened. They sit me down with her and basically she says, I'm like so sorry for what happened. And you're like my best friend, so I would never do that to you like ever. Be best friend? Who is your best friend? I'm your best friend? Oh, no, 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 no. I was like, uh-uh, girl, I'm not taking an apology. I started shaking my head like, mm-mm, you, you is not, you know, you is not a good friend, and you is also not gonna apologize to me because I ain't gonna accept that apology. So, basically what happens is I just pretty much just reject her. I'm like, mm, girl, like, you is not, you is a sandwich, is what you are. And that's the story of how I got to meet Melinda the Sandwich, and I, to this day, still don't like her. I mean, I don't really know her, but like if I were to still have her in my life, I don't think I would like her because you threw sand in my eyes and that, that means that we have bad blood between each other. So yeah, that's my, that's my story of the sandwich. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up as always. Please, please, please subscribe to my channel to get more videos and I will see you all on Friday for my first ever Friday video. Bye. are just pieces, just little fragments of what I